of 11 last year. He's had three opportunities on the track this season and has been no worse than second. McClure aboard for trainer play and owner determination. It's post time for tonight's third race. Often trotting McClure careful with forbidden trade as was Mayotte with Okeanos. A great beginning there for Winsong Patriot who is fast off the wings from down the center. Chris Christopher set sail for the lead with Winsong Patriot. Into the pocket spot is Cool Clifford. An opportunity to maybe wedge in there or maybe drive on. Drive on it is. Jameson puts the pedal down. Driving up on the far outside into third goes Dream Nation for Dubé. And in behind them from in fourth is Night Angel with a good seat in the early going. Off the speed from fifth. Magical Journey. Six to the rail is Magical Winter Okay. Then it's the favorite forbidden trade. Okeanos in the last one away is while you're up. First panel was 27 and 1, and it's Dubé sweeping up to grab the top now, putting Dream Nation on the motor. Into the pocket spot goes Cool Clifford Winsong Patriot from third. Night Angel off the speed from back and forth there. Fifth inside to Magical Journey, popping out six. Magical Winner K. It's another two and a half lengths back there to Forbidden Trade from in seventh. Racing up from an eighth is Okeanos, and the trailer from a ninth remains wild. While you're up. 56 and 3 was the opening half. They move into the final turn and they do so, chasing Dream Nation, getting a bit of separation between himself and the others. It's a two length gap back to Cool Clifford. Night Angel first up out of third now for McNair. Back into fourth is Winsong Patriot, suddenly gapping on cover. Magical Winner K. Then inside to Magical Journey. Forbidden Trade is held up here. He's following poor cover on the way to three quarters. McClure's got him seven off the lead. Three quarters of a mile in 125 and they spin for home and the one to catch Dream Nation. Dream Dream Nation is upset-minded. Night Angels on the outside from in second. Cool Clifford back into third and way out wide forbidden trade, but he simply has too far to come at this point. They're into deep stretch. Still there, Dream Nation. Down the center, Night Angel. Now forbidden trade starts to trot ahead. And forbidden trade is powering up on the extreme outside. Forbidden trade closing from a real tough spot to win. How impressive was that? Forbidden trade to win it by a length. Dream Nation second, Night Angel third. The mile 153 and one. Termination of Montreal, Quebec. Luke Blay trains in the bike for the winning drive. That's Bob McClure, second victory in four starts on the year for Forbidden Trade. Victorious in 153 and one, matching his lifetime best. First of two OSS golds on this Monday night from Woodbine Mohawk Park going to this guy, and that is Bob McClure as cool as the other side of the pillow because uh, turning for home, I was thinking, is he going to get there? What was your thought uh, process throughout this race? Well, uh, he's got a wicked turn of speed, and uh, he loves to chase them. So I was still pretty confident. He felt really good. Uh, I'd used him, you know, two, three times in the last couple weeks. You know, it's a long year. I wanted to just try and save one move today, and uh, his one move is pretty substantial. So I figured the way they were getting out of there, he, he still had a shot at it. That was impressive through the lane. Um, speaking of impressive, go back to last year. He won 7 of 11, so he proved that he was, you know, going to be a nice one. This year, though, it seems like he's sort of just taking his game to another level. Well, last year, I think he excelled because he was like a 4-year-old in a 2-year-old season. You know, he was uh, so mentally ahead of everybody else. He was easy to drive, good gated. He didn't have to worry about much. This year, it seems like he, you know, he's winning races on talent. He's, uh, he's gotten to be, uh, I think, one of the top Colts. It's not often you win a couple of races in a couple of days in different provinces, but that's the case for you because over the weekend, you were at Century Downs in Alberta having uh, some fun and supporting a good cause as well with Colin Kelly and James McDonald. Uh, just a quick word on that. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. We went down to Calgary there, and uh, any charity event's always a good time, but uh, they really rolled out the red carpet for us, and uh, can't wait to go back. Congratulations on that. Congratulations on this, and uh, good luck uh, the rest of the night. Thank you very much. Bob McClure, the only guy who can go for the OSS sweep tonight. He's going to drive Fingal's wave coming up a little bit later on for Dustin Jones. Wins here tonight with Forbidden Trade, who gets his ninth lifetime win, equaling his best, 153-1. Price is up. One forbidden trade, $230. $2 exact to $620. Trifecta, $8.